Hi folks and welcome to this week's Ferrari Fix track guide at Imola. Fantastic circuit and you will see something different. We have a second car on screen. This was in the practice session that I stream on Monday night. So they're the Monday before the Sunday that they come out, if that makes any sense at all. And the race in line popped in to uh, come and uh, show us round the track. And uh, he did muck up our lap time. Of course he did. He came in and distracted me immensely. He was slightly faster, annoyingly. He did a uh, an illegal 42.9, I think it was. Let's have a nose of what actually finished. There we go. Had a few off tracks, but I did a genuine, a 43.287 was the actual genuine lap because that one had an off track as well because that brings me on to this. Read these rules, go out and practice them and find out where the off tracks are. They have changed and they are annoying because you can't take some of the curbs that you used to take and you can take more curbs so go out and learn the new off tracks it will benefit your laps immensely otherwise the info i'm going to show you we are identical to the sprint setup and i did roll the brake bias two or three clicks to the rear tires so i can't remember what the uh off the top of my head what the baseline is but i did roll it back so it was a lower percentage on the front track usage 45 percent is what i always use and track temp 84 fahrenheit degrees will be above my head as mentioned the lap i'm going to show you that is jack so we don't want that one we want my lap so it is lap wherever it is lap 20 so you see lap 18 was actually my fast lap but that had an off track so lap 20 a 143 287 is what we're doing above my head you should see my discord where the olap be lap telemetry and replay file will be in there also a little google docs to show you what track guys have done in the past and where they appear in the season schedule also up there how is how i get into these sessions to so try and make them as accurate as possible to the actual race event so i use the ui which is brilliant for what uh, if you want to practice before the weeks go live otherwise enough of me waffling let's crack on with the guide right then the festival of speed that is imola great little circuit this along with monza in italy so we are hunting down to turn one that is actually turn three or turn two sorry so that little service road just to the right hand side we are breaking in a nice straight line really heavy get it all the way down in second gear clip the curb as we go through it don't hit the sausage curbs it will bounce all over them as we'll find out in a minute and uh, clip turn three very nicely full power now we are actually through this kink we are actually full throttle so don't worry about it in the slightest use the astro turf on exit but watch out for that graph that appears right there now this is a very fun corner so at the 50 board we are breaking and we're going down uh, i think one or two gears i think i'll do it before the corner no nope, one gear in the fourth miss the curb break heavily again on the second part down a second and this is where i clip the sausage curb you can see how much it affects the car at this slow speed so any quicker through there and it really does affect it quite a lot 50 meter board or the service road on the right hand side break again in a straight line and this is a lovely hairpin night get a nice late apex here and get on throttle as soon as you can so i miss it by about half a car length car width or whatever but you use all of the exit as long as you get on throttle early you will gain nice easy lap time it's uphill as well so there's going to be an overtaking opportunity into the very fast kink up here which is very very awkward due to the new ruling 50 meter board just after it we are standing on it and make sure you don't run too far wide on this one give the curb a cheeky little tickle as you go past and make sure you keep a tire on the black stuff while we go around there you used to be able to go out and use the astro turf but with the new ruling you cannot do that 50 meter board we are turning to the apex now coming into this very tricky section miss the curb it unsettles the car and braking but basically don't lift off the brakes use this curve and use that as a marker as well when to turn in should be nicely on second gear here again miss the sausage curbs and this actually does make an advantage of the new rolling we can use a bit more of this curve on the left hand side get out of there let the car run naturally out to the right hand side of the track and then bring it over to the left hand side for the chicane that has given me the most amount of pain while recording this track guide we used to better cut this corner by quite a lot but not anymore so just before the 50 meter board we are standing on the brakes all the way down the gears and basically you want to make sure you keep either the opposite side of the corner car if that makes sense so if you're going around the right hand side keep the left hand tires on the black stuff if you go around the left hand they keep the right hand tires guys on the tarmac yeah that's the only way you can get around there without getting off track i foresee a lot of off tracks through there it is quicker to cut them but you will get off tracks downhill braking zone we're actually braking quite early just after the 100 meter board really heavy on the brakes you can see there keep it in a straight line all the way down to first gear try and get some engine braking as well turn in early because it will naturally understeer going downhill as well don't run too far wide again but nip it up in second nicely and graze the brakes while you clip that apex and make sure you don't get any wheel spin coming out of this corner most important on the circuit that one because you are down the longest straight on the circuit so you need a brilliant brilliant exit 
but we hunt for the line you will get slipstream to the line so be mindful of that make sure you do get a good exit but we hunt to the line with a 143 287 so slightly sh slower than i showed you in the um in the intro there but otherwise still a pretty decent lap in my opinion watch out for off tracks that is going to be the theme of this week your safety rating will get a tanking through here because i think in an hour practice session i was up to 50 or 60 off tracks so yeah be mindful of that otherwise check out the racing lines video he normally releases his uh if you're watching on sunday he normally releases his on a monday his channel will be linked down at the bottom there he is a brilliant guy and uh yeah go and have fun go and tell him i sent you and uh, tell him that my track guides are better otherwise thank you very much for watching catch you on the next one